tell me the story about this. We've got a little cockatiel to examine next. What's the story? Well, I can start from the beginning on that one, then leave it to Mary Claude. It right, was donated okay. by, by a woman who had three cockatiels, yes. and they were in the most chronic condition, yes. living condition. Yes. Um, and she couldn't cope with them, as she had about six cats as yes. well. Yes. So she asked Miles to take them, and yep. there were two adults and this one. Yes. The two adults are okay, yes. although fairly um, shy, yes. but this little one here would be constantly fluffed. Yes and just would sit in the cage and the others would pick on it and she can't fly, whereas right. the others are now in an aviary. Right, okay. And so I took her out of there and then Mary Claude would take over. Right, yeah, fine. Okay. Well, yes, I said, uh, yes, so I, I tried uh, just, because um, her poo didn't look good, Yep. I just put her on uh, coxivet for a week in yes. coxivet in her water and batrill just yes. to see if she would get better. Yes. Not a real change, so I stopped. Right. I stopped, and she hasn't had any um, medicine for about three weeks. Right. She's still okay. losing weight. Yep. She eats. Yep. Okay. Well, the first things I noticed as soon as I saw her, I noticed two things. I noticed the color of her plumage. I noticed that the she has um, the, the powder down feathers across her, on each of her flanks, across here, are very, very long and wispy. Yeah. They're sticking out here as great wispy things on both sides. And that that is very, very abnormal. So she is not producing normal colour, normal powder. Um, uh, the powder downs are what we call dystrophic or very wispy. That's these feathers here. Uh, and um, that is and that they're, they're pinched off as they're coming through the skin. So there is a high probability that this birdie is a a beacon feather bird um, of the cockatiel variety. So and the other thing that we notice is that her plumage, the feathers are, are dystrophic. The, they're much narrower than a normal cockatiel's feather. So they're longer, longer and narrower. Um, on both wings. So now that is sometimes due to other things such as um, uh, thyroid dysfunction. We've, we've considered it maybe thyroid. We'll stop that there. I have to answer this. 